Hi guys, I'm here with my beautiful friend Staj. We're going to be doing um, a taste test, first impressions review of some vegan dips from Trader Joe's. And I have to give Nastasia credit because I didn't even know Trader Joe's had all these dips. Um, so she was in charge of getting the dips. You want to tell us the dips we're trying? Yeah, so we have four dips. The first one is a vegan nacho dip. The second is a vegan salmon esque spread with capers and dill. I'm not excited for that. <laughs> Sounds I don't, good. I don't eat seafood, I, even when I eat meat. The third one is a vegan buffalo dip. And the last one is a vegan, how do you say this word? <laughs> tzatziki? Tzatziki dip. Like I read it tzatziki, so I know how to spell it, but I think it's yeah. <laughs> tzatziki, <That dip. laughs> I think. So I'm vegetarian and Staj is vegan, um, but like, I, I don't really miss eating meat, but one thing I do miss is like buffalo wings, mm -hmm. but they have like cauliflower wings, yeah. like there's so many alternatives and it's just the sauce, mm -hmm. like you could put buffalo yeah. sauce on anything, so I'm like super excited for mm -hmm. that. So since Staj got the dips, I did chips and then she suggested to get crackers too, so I got these everything bagel crackers, which Staj she said they were okay, <laughs> but I haven't tried them and I love- They're not bad, they're not bad. I love the everything bagel seasoning, so that works. <laughs> and then I got these organic corn chip dippers. They looked interesting. They kind of remind me of like Fritos. Yeah. Like they gave me Fritos vibes, mm -hmm. and I loved Fritos when I was younger. And then I got these blue corn tortilla chips. I was gonna get like the plain yellow ones, mm -hmm. but I wanted some variety. Okay. So that's why I got Yeah, because we already have the corn chips. Yeah. But yeah, so let's let's, let's do, it. do it. Which one do you want to do first? Um, hmm. Let's start with the nacho dip. Okay, let's do it. Alright, so we got the vegan nacho dip. I'm nervous to try it. I'm gonna smell it. It's thick. It is thick. I feel like... She's thick. <laughs> <laughs> She's real thick. With two C's. Tastes cheesy. That's weird, it does. It kind of tastes like, what is that? Is it to Tostitos? The queso dip? I kind of taste it. I want to try it with one I of these. I feel like the consistency, it reminds me of like those snacks you had as a kid with like the stick crackers. I know what it. you're yeah. talking yeah. about. And I don't <laughs> Because I didn't like those. I don't want to think that it tastes like that. <laughs> the like, consistency well, does. It reminds me of that. Because it's thick. Yeah. I wonder if this melts. Because you know, like, vegan cheese doesn't always... Because yeah. if, if you melt it, it would be a little bit thinner. Mm -hmm. I like it. Mm -hmm. Okay, Trader Joe's. Okay. Okay. That's good. I'm actually really surprised because I love cheese. I'm lactose intolerant. I'm not supposed to have it, but I have it anyway. <laughs> But like in moderation, you know, like I know my limits. So it's like, it's hard for me to find a vegan cheese that I like. Yeah. So that, okay. That's pretty good, yeah. If you had to rate it on a scale of one to 10, what would you, what would your rating be? Um, I would say an eight. I was gonna do like 8.5. Yeah, it's pretty yeah. good. Okay, <laughs> I like that one. Just because you're not looking forward to it. No! <laughs> no! Let's do the Salmon-esque spread. Why did they have to get bougie like that and say Salmon-esque? With say capers and dill. What are capers? <laughs> um, I'm not too sure. You don't else. know? Nope. You got this and you don't even know what I don't know what are? capers are. <laughs> I, I think it's something you put in like tuna or, or something. I don't know. Oh, God. You're making it even <laughs> Tuna? Like tuna salad or something like that. <laughs> I'm really not looking forward to this one. I'm sorry. I just, I'm not a seafood person. Like even when I ate meat, I, I, I've tried fish. I don't know if I ever tried salmon though. Everyone raves about it. I mean, when I used to eat meat, I liked salmon. So it's, it's I feel like you're going to be better at reviewing this one because I have nothing <laughs> You're to You're biased. <laughs> yeah, I just, I have, and I have nothing to compare it to because yeah. I don't even know if I've ever had 
real salmon. I'm not stalling. <laughs> I promise. It I'm, sounds like you I'm are, but <laughs> let's get to it. Ugh. It has like little like salmon like pieces in there. It's so crazy. I'm trying to tell myself it's not real salmon so that I don't. Okay. That was a baby dip. No. <laughs> it, it's on there. Okay. Cheers. <laughs> It's kind of salty. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna finish it, but I don't like it. I, yeah. It's not fair. I like it. It reminds me of like when you go to brunch and some people get like salmon or lox or with cream cheese. That's what it kind of tastes like. That's all I'm really tasting. I'm tasting like cream cheese. I taste the mayo. Mm-hmm. You know it's weird? Like, you know when you can smell things and you can taste it? Like, I've smelled salmon. Mm -hmm. It's like, just from like, remembering the smell, I can kind of taste the salmon. Mm -hmm. It's just not for me. But I like it. If you like salmon, yeah. take Staj's word for it. She <laughs> likes it. So do you have a rating for this one? Um, It was a little salty, but I do like the taste. It would be good on like a bagel or some toast. So... I'm gonna give it. I'll give this one an eight too. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Solid <laughs> Trader Joe's. Yeah. They're doing good. Mm -hmm. They're doing good. <laughs> I've seen, I've seen people do like um, salmon on a bagel. Yeah. Again, I don't get it, but listen, that's all. Yeah, that's would... what I meant. Like yeah. before, like this, they call it lox. So like yeah. salmon with cream cheese. On the bagel. That's what lox is? Mm -hmm. Salmon with cream cheese. Yeah. Oh my god, I, n I never knew what it was. <laughs> so I would see it and I'm like, what's, what's lox? Yeah. Like, I wasn't going to try it, so it didn't really matter, but I just wondered. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. So if you're into salmon, give it a try. We got through it. We got through it. It was good. <laughs> I got through it. We're just, we're just going to put this. I'll buy it again. <laughs> I don't know about Jen, but I'll buy it again. We're going to put this one away. <laughs> This is like, like when I get falafel, like a gyro, mm, yeah. they, they put that on there. Mm -hmm. Ooh, I don't know what chip to do. I'm going to do the corn chip. There's just like so many options. I know. It's, it's overwhelming. <laughs> I like this one. You know my favorite? See, I'm not nervous for this one. Mmm, I taste the cucumber. That's refreshing. This would be nice in the summer. Mm-hmm. Like, I just taste summer. Yeah. Or if I did, I would dip my falafel in this. This is good. Mm-hmm. What do you rate it? <laughs> um... <laughs> I'll give that one an, an eight. Oh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Wait, what did you give the salmon one? I didn't rate it. Oh, it's <laughs> so rate it. Uh, I mean, I don't want to be mean and give it like a oh two. Oh boy. No, it's it's just not for me. Like, mm -hmm. it, it, honestly, it wasn't bad. We could do a four. Sheesh. <laughs> I just I don't. It's hard because it wasn't I don't like it. It wasn't bad. Just just listen to stuff for that one. <laughs> don't, don't don't take my advice because I yeah. <laughs> all right, all right. I'll give it like a. A 5.5. Okay, a 5.5 for the Salmon S for Jen. Mm -hmm. And then the tzatziki. Oh, you said it right. Oh, I did? It. Yeah. <laughs> you saw yourself be like, oh, that sounded nice. <laughs> okay, so 5.5 mm -hmm. for the Salmon S. And then this one I gave a an 8. Okay. What did you give this one? I'll give it? that one... I give it a 7. Okay. Yeah. All right. We're, we're being critical. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. It was good, but it wasn't like, it didn't blow me away. Yeah. It was everything that I expected. I'll say that. Hmm. No, I, I can see that. I'm just, it's not my favorite. Mm -hmm. Like even um, the non-vegan one, I don't, I don't eat it too much, mm -hmm. but 
I, I was impressed. Like, yeah. I, I think it tastes very close mm -hmm. to the regular one. All right. Last but not least, if I can open it. Oh my God, I can open it. <laughs> there we go. It's chunky. <laughs> Is it supposed to be like buffalo chicken? I don't Is know. It? it says buffalo style. So because you, like regular like non-vegan buffalo dip is usually buffalo chicken dip, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. so, yeah. So that's probably why it's kind of chunky looking. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. All right. I'm ready. This one I'm not scared. <laughs> A little bit. Because <laughs> what if it's not good? Hmm. I gotta try it again. I don't know. Hmm. I'm thinking. I'm processing. This is not what I was expecting it to taste like. I like it. It's different, mm -hmm. but I like it too. Mm -hmm. I just, I'm trying to figure out what it tastes like. It's not buffalo chicken. No. But it's pretty good. But I feel like this would be good with like vegetables too. Mm. Like cucumbers or... I would dip a cucumber in mm -hmm. it. I like it. Yeah, I approve. Did it live up to your expectations, Jen? <laughs> <laughs> yes and no. It's just different. Mm -hmm. I was like, I was tasting the buffalo chicken in my head. Like I, I should have just lowered my yeah. expectations. <laughs> life, life lesson. <laughs> we gotta, we gotta apply that to real life. <laughs> Out of all of them. That one I had to like analyze the most. Yeah, just same. to figure out the flavor. I don't know how to describe it. It tastes very, it's unique, but it's good. Mm -hmm. It's really good. I think it's spicy enough. I I really like spicy, so I would almost make it a little spicier. But I feel like to please everybody, that's a good amount of spice. Mm -hmm. I almost would say for this one, like mix it before you eat it because yeah, we didn't do that. Yeah, because. The other ones were thicker, mm -hmm. so this one, I feel like the flavors are like spread out. So maybe if we mixed it, yeah. it would taste better. But I kind of want to go back to the cheese one. Mm. I want to like retaste it because I really like this one. We're gonna heat this up and then come back. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we we heated up the cheese um, to see if it would change the taste. Stodge thinks she overheated it. I think it's you can fine. see all the oil too. Yeah, it's like so much thinner now. Mm -hmm. Like I'm glad we did that because I'm curious. It's really hot though, so while it cools, what would you rate the buffalo? The buffalo, <clears throat> I'm gonna give it a 7.5. That's literally what I was gonna give it. Really? <laughs> yeah. I was between 7.5 or 8. Mm -hmm. I think I'm gonna. Stick with 7.5. Yeah. It was it was really good. It's just not... If you're looking for, like, buffalo chicken, that's... It's not it. But, mm. like, a good buffalo dip, you like spicy, yeah. it's, it's good. I would definitely recommend it. Mm. I would try it. I feel like that would be good on a sandwich, too. Ooh. Like, as a spread or something. I didn't even think of that. Mm -hmm. mm. Or, like, mix mm. some, like, chickpeas with it. Just, like, roasted chickpeas? Yeah. Hmm. I might have to try that. That sounds good. <laughs> with some rice? You're getting so creative because I was just thinking like, like just eat it with a chip. Mm -hmm. Like literally just a dip. But you can use these like spreads too. Mm -hmm. Like she was saying like the salmon one, like cream cheese. This, I, I was thinking the tzatziki. Tzatziki. <laughs> this, I'm just going to be so like self-conscious. Someone's going to correct us. <laughs> it's, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Um. This, yeah, I would definitely put that like on a gyro or a Mediterranean bowl, you know, like with the rice, mm -hmm. you could put chickpeas, all the veggies. Before we try that, so Staj has her own business. She is a fashionista. She's always dressed super cute and amazing, um, but she has her own business. It's called Edge, Ele Edge 11, yes. right? Edge okay. 11. Uh, do you want to tell us like where we can find you like what kind of clothing you sell yep so we're on all uh social media platforms so instagram facebook <clears throat> tiktok and you can find us at edge11.com 
we focus more so on edgy pieces, on unique pieces, pieces that you can wear in different ways and style in different ways. So check us out. Yes. And yeah. <laughs> I just placed my first order. I'm so excited. Yes. <laughs> I wanted to get more. When you when you put more stuff up, I'll definitely I'll be a returning customer. I didn't even get my order yet, and I know it's I know I'm gonna love it. Yeah. She's she's amazing. She's a hard worker. Her stuff is quality. Definitely check her out. I'll put Stash and her business, her Instagram and everything in the description below so you guys can find her. Definitely please check her out and support her. Yes. Um, <laughs> yeah, get get some cute clothes and stuff. Mm -hmm. and, you know? Be ready, ready for the runway. <laughs> we got everything or, you need. <laughs> or the party, what, whatever you need an outfit for, definitely, definitely check her out. I'm gonna try out the cracker. I'm just, I'm just a chip girl. Miss, oh, these crackers aren't that good. And you've been <laughs> reaching for the crackers. I didn't say they're not that good, they're not great. She said they're basic. They're a little dry. She said that off camera. <laughs> she blew up my spot. <laughs> I had to. Okay. Mmm. Is it better? Mm-hmm. I can't get it on the chip. It doesn't want to stay. That tastes really good. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. I mean... That might get bumped up to like a, a 9. <laughs> I will even give that like a 9.5. Oh, okay. <laughs> I, I told you I love cheese. That's really good. It's crazy because I thought the buffalo was going to be my favorite. No, because it's hot. Mm -hmm. It literally, because even when you get the, you know, growing up I got like the regular cheese one. We would heat it up and it would just game changer. Mm -hmm. It's good like that, but now that I had it warm, I don't know if I could. Especially because you said it, it's like yeah. those little things, <laughs> those little snack things that we ate when we were little. Yeah. <laughs> so... We tried all these fabulous dips. Shout out to Trader Joe's. They have they have so much stuff, so much variety with like vegan stuff. Yes, like every they're my go-to for sure. They're I mean Whole Foods is good too, but they can get pricey. Yeah, mm -hmm. there's some stuff that's surprisingly not bad at yeah. Whole Foods, but <clears throat> I do most of my shopping at Trader Joe's, and ever since I went vegetarian, like. It's just, it's a game changer. Mm -hmm. Like they, they literally have everything. And I rarely try anything from there that I don't like. Yeah. I've had some stuff that was like, okay, but for the most part, it was really good. But these, if you guys haven't tried these, definitely check them out. I would highly, highly recommend them. Even the one that I didn't like. <laughs> just, it's, it's only because I don't, I don't like seafood. So I'm kind of biased, but like. I personally thought it was really good. Staj liked it, so if you're if you are a vegan and you were a seafood lover, you'll like it. There you go. <laughs> I'm just That's gonna, my take on it. <laughs> I'm just not gonna talk about that. I think it's better if I just don't talk about it. Okay. So which one was your least favorite? My least favorite. Was, we're not gonna agree on this. Maybe you should no, do not. do your own. So Staj will do her ranking. And then I'll do mine. My least favorite is going to be the buffalo. So I did like it, but it didn't blow me away, you know. So that's my least favorite. That's um, fair. So we're going to put the buffalo. Yes. <laughs> I'll say the tzatziki, tzatziki, however you say it. It's really good. It's really refreshing. I think it's... You can use it more than just a dip. That's what I like about it. Mm -hmm. And yeah, it tasted really good. So that's next. And then. Girl, um, if you say the salmon is your favorite, <laughs> I'm walking out. No, I'm going to say the salmon is next. It tastes, it's it's crazy how much it tastes like salmon. Like, it's crazy. I don't know. There's a lot of ingredients to read on here. So I don't really know the specifics as far as how they make it taste like salmon. But they did a really good job with that. Um oh the only thing is it's a little bit salty, so that's the only like downside to it. But other than that, like I will be, you know, toasting a bagel, putting this on there, eating it for breakfast. Like it's really good to me. Number one. And number one, number one on the pyramid, if you know, <laughs> if you 
watch TikTok. And <laughs> Jen doesn't watch TikTok. So Dang, she doesn't know what I'm just talking not about. like that. <laughs> Number one on the pyramid I is the vegan nacho dip. Yes. The vegan nacho dip. Cold or hot. I love it. <laughs> yes, you've been making a commercial. And it's organic, okay? Is Trader Joe's sponsoring you? Nope. <laughs> And look at the packaging. It has little flowers on it. The packaging is really cute. Mm -hmm. On all of them. I think it's yeah. really cute. But that one, I like yeah. the flowers. It's cute. Uh, we already know what's last. <laughs> you don't know that. I might surprise you. Oh, okay. I don't even want to like... <laughs> I don't even want to look at it. Okay. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hurt your feelings. I'm sorry. All right. So... I don't, I don't even need to explain. This guy was not my favorite. I will not be returning to it. All right. This is hard. Can I do a tie? No. All right. I'm going to put the tzatziki second to last. Okay. We it's, both have that. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like, we have similar just you like salmon. <laughs> I think this is really good. It's just even the non-vegan version i'm just i don't use it a lot like if i do it's like a little bit but it's good i, I would definitely like if you're into this stuff try it um yeah this guy we're just gonna leave him there it's the buffalo again this was very good i i really enjoyed it it just I think I, I set my expectation too high. Yeah. I should have known better. I just, I see buffalo, I see spicy, and I get excited. I'm sorry. <laughs> it was good, though. It, it was, was good. good. And then number one, we already know. <laughs> the vegan nacho dip. Nacho cheese. Whatever you want to call it. Like nacho thing. cheese. Nacho cheese. <laughs> <laughs> I can't stand you. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's good cold, but honestly, now that I've tried it hot, like, that's the only way I want it, is it's good, because <laughs> it, it's a little thick when it's like this, but it's good. I just, now that we heated it up, it's total game changer. Like, if you get this, you need to warm it up. Yeah. Like, try it cold first, and then warm it up, mm -hmm. and I promise you, it's, it's going to change your life. And... I'm over here thinking like, oh, jeez, I need to relax. Like, I don't want to be in pain later, but it's not. Yeah. It's very free. <laughs> like, I'm waiting for like the stomach ache to kick in, but I'm just like, oh, we can finish this and right. be fine. Like, <laughs> yes. Plants. Sweet and plants, baby. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm actually, I'm actually really hyped. Like you, I have to thank Stash for this because this video was her idea. Um. I've been eating just like chips with salsa. Like I don't get cheese dip anymore, but now I can get this one. Because the other ones, they just, they hurt. Yeah. They hurt my stomach. But like, I miss it, you know? Mm -hmm. Do you want to rank these? Like, do sure. you have a favorite with the chips and crackers? Um, no, they pretty much tasted how I expected them to taste. Um, tortillas are tortillas. <laughs> corn chips. The corn chips are pretty good though. Yeah. These are, I never tried these before. They're organic <laughs> corn chip, and they call them dippers, which makes sense because they're these are good. Like if you want to sco mm -hmm. scoop a lot, those are good. Sometimes on the chip, I'm a chip person. Like if I if I had to pick one, I would probably pick these because I just like a good old, you know, basic yeah. corn tortilla chip, but like <laughs> tortilla. <laughs> All right, so that wraps up our vegan dip taste test um thank you stash for coming on the channel we're definitely gonna be seeing more of her we're gonna do more videos together um but yeah thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video and i'll see you in the next video bye guys bye i wanted to film the video with stash's tree in the background but she said it's not christmas anymore not. so mm -hmm. i just wanted to show you guys her tree isn't it beautiful look at it look at the details <laughs> Did you buy it like this? Like, it looks so perfect. Oh, no. Oh, it's so pretty. <laughs> Reindeer. <laughs>